Okay, hey guys, um, so what I have for you today is I have, uh, this little contraption here. Uh, this contraption took 20 minutes at the most. I thought I would show it off. You're probably wondering what it does. Well, let me, uh, flip this lever up. It didn't come very prepared because I want to rush through this video because I'm gonna be leaving soon. Uh, Let's just show you. So, I built this castle a while ago. I'll give you a quick, quick run around of it. I started this project a few months ago, and I only work on it every once in a while. That's a beacon, by the way. Um, I just kind of work on it when I'm bored, and since the new update with command blocks came out, I decided I'd give this a try. So, button that does nothing. You press it, and then it says, well, it did something. Now here's the impressive part about it, it's when you flip this lever, and I'm gonna codename this the evil lever, and I'm gonna hide it somewhere else eventually. When you press that lever, and then you press this button, it goes to the pretend evil room for now. And what this lever does is this does something completely unrelated, there's like a gate here. Any anyway, I'll show you kind of how it works, uh via a different world. So this is pretty much the same setup. So what happens is this piston is extended and uh, a quick lesson in redstone is that whenever a uh, repeater goes into a block it can go through the block. So let me uh, show you an example. I'll use the piston so you can see it better. Whenever you press this, it can go through the block and activate this redstone. Now, it can't just go through air, though. I'll show you an example. It can't just go through air. So, uh, oops. Oh well. I'll fix that later. I have a bunch of contraptions and whatnot here. Um, I usually never post too many of them, though, because I'm not into it. So, this is going to be our good room, I guess. I kind of switched them around on accident, so uh, that's actually supposed to be what the bad room's going to be, and this is the bad room, but it's supposed to be the good room. So you flip this, and it says good. And then you flip this, and it says bad. Oh, I guess I did switch it around. So the way that works is uh, this little circuit right here. So I'll build it for you real fast. So it's really simple. It's in uh it's an inverter. Well, sort of an inverter. Hey, this part of it's an inverter, but uh yeah. So basically whenever this is pushed, it turns off this torch and this piston retracts and then it uh there is no torch here, so the signal goes directly into here and this extends. So basically what this means is I'll show you. Uh oops. I'll just put some here. And then I'll put some pistons here to show you. These pistons are our are or uh test pistons. So whenever you flip this then a signal is sent through there. But uh I'm getting rid of these torches. And so whenever uh Depending on if this lever is flipped or not, a lever can be sent through here or here. So since it's not flipped, the, le the uh, signal can be sent through here. And since it is flipped now, it uh, can be sent through here. So uh, that was pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, it just took me 10 minutes to figure out how everything worked because I couldn't think of a simple design for it. I uh, tried some stuff with AND gates and that wasn't very fun and pigs enjoy this design and enjoy playing with it if even if you're not going to do anything with it and just have it in your world pigs like playing with it so yeah thanks for watching everyone goodbye <laughs>